Hello everyone and welcome back to Chronos Plays Dragon Age Inquisition. Today we are gonna finish Vivian's quest. We're gonna look for the Snowy Wyvern. I'm also stealth because I went to increase my uh, level. Well, alright, I went to level up a skill point and I accidentally hit the wrong button as I'm known to do. I'm gonna assume the, the Snowy, wi Snowy Wyvern, Wyvern is around here. But we might as well take care of this rift, even though we have no more potions, and everyone's kind of weak. But we got this. We've <laughs> taken on worse. Everyone got the barrier but me. That's just not fair. Really, Solus? Same old, same old. Actually, that one was pretty easy. Mostly just uh, those shade guys. We had a despair demon in there for a little bit, but... Activate! That should help ward off demons. Yeah, goddamn right it is. So there's a landmark up here. Right here. Offering to the Dreadwolf. Huh. Probably should have read that. Ah, there's all my codex. There's a lot of stuff to read in this game. Reading's not my specialty. Most of the time. To be honest, you play a lot of old JRPGs that don't have any voice acting. I, uh, I know. What the hell is that? Is that it? No, that looks like a Garut. That looks like three of them. Vivian, why are you all the way up there? You should be behind Iron Bull. What the fuck? You're a mage. You're not even a battle mage. You're just a straight up healing mage. Oh. Snowy Wyvern. <coughs> Sassen Dugan! There's fucking a lot of them here. Also, this guy has a lot of health. I mean, not that much, but it seems like a lot. Right? Or am I just like... Ow! He does a lot of damage, too. Also, someone put him to sleep. Oh, he's like a special level 15. You can tell by the icon he needs his, uh, his, uh, name. Vivian's almost dead. Just like a snowy dragon. Well, snowy wyvern. You better appreciate this, Vivian. Heart, hello! You came out of nowhere. You're a lot easier. Like, stupidly easier. Alright, let's get the F out of here. Wait a minute. Weren't there Venatori I could kill? Or did I already do that? Broken dog. Oh, it's right there. Oh, but I have to... What do I have to do? Oh, okay. So we come back here. No? No, we don't go back there? Why, are we in combat? Yeah, we're in combat. So we go back here. Okay, you know what? We'll, we'll go check that out, because I've never seen that on a map before. Now, I've seen the the location marker. I just I have never seen it crossed out before. So we'll come over here, check that out. Then we'll teleport back to the camp. Heal up. Restock on our supplies, and then kill those Venatori for uh, Dorian. And seriously, wait, you're the guys that kept respawning earlier, aren't you? That's oh, we have one potion left. Totally gonna use that for myself. You're dead. And there's another one. You are frozen. Turn into like a snowy wave in there. I don't care who you attack, we all have a barrier up. To be quite honest. Well, we'll loot him, I guess. Might as well. There. Here? Broken dog. Interesting. Alright, let's head back to the camp. Alright, we should be good to go on everything. Get back here, Pona. I think we just gotta go through here and the Venatori guys will be here. 
That's what the map's making it sound like, or seem like. After that, we'll, we'll teleport to Skyhold, we'll talk to Vivian, we'll give her the heart. And... Mum's the word. Monsieur? What? Scarecrow. Oh, these guys? Really? They're just kind of standing here. Good lord. You die. They're level 11. Oh, don't step in that. Ah, but we were already in it when it blew up. Oh, well. Dorian greatly approves. Of course he does. This thing around here? Ah, oh, there's loot over there. I don't know who we killed over here that had loot, but whatevs. Time to go back to Skyhold. I don't know what you think you're doing. I'm being clucked at by a hen, evidently. Don't play the fool with me, young man. If I wanted to play the fool, I could be rather more convincing, I assure you. Your glib tongue does you no credit. You'd be surprised at the credit my tongue gets me, Your Reverence. Okay. Uh, yeah, so upstairs and through a... No, it's just through this door, I think, Vivian's at. Yeah. So I think that was the cut... Well, not cutscene, but event we were supposed to see when we were talking to Dorian last time. Anyways, Vivian. What can I do for you, my dear? Is it too much to hope that you've brought me the heart of the snowy wyvern? I can see your butt. I've got the heart. Now talk. If you want the wyvern's heart, you'll tell me what you're using it for. I can do better, darling. Give me the heart, and I'll show you what it's for. Will that suffice? Very well, here it is. All right. One heart as requested. How kind of you. Please accept this as your payment. I must begin work immediately. I should apologize. I must admit that I had completely misjudged you, Inquisitor. I Thank you for the blue stuff. would like you to come with me to see this through. Sure. You just had to ask. Also, you disapproved of me giving the heart. I think it's because I was like, tell me what you're doing with this heart. I didn't think, I didn't see that other option. This should only take a moment, Inquisitor. You look unhappy. Are we going to have another emotional scene? I don't think my tear ducts can handle that. I'm here, my darling. So this is... She's giving her anti-aging stuff to the old man. Yes, darling. It's going to be all right. Oh, he did. My darling, Bastian. I gave her the right heart, right? Oh shit! I have to look at that in editing. I didn't. I didn't do the lie one, right? Oh fuck. Uh, I am so sorry. Vivienne, I'm sorry. There's nothing here now. So you're single. I don't know what you think you're doing. I'm being clucked at by a hen, evidently. Don't play the fool with me, young man. If I wanted to play the fool, I could be rather more convincing, I assure you. Your glib tongue does you no credit. You'd be surprised at the credit my tongue gets me, Your Reverence. Is that going to happen every time I come up here? Because that's not going to get old fast. Maybe I can, I'll talk to him afterwards. Maybe there's something I can talk to him about. And it'll cut away. Anyway, it's Vivian. Bastian is dead. I can hardly believe. But it you greatly approve, apparently. Ball. My first visit to the Imperial Palace. The Circle sent a dozen of us to entertain the nobility. I was in awe of everyone and everything. And then our eyes met. Bastien spent the entire ball at my side. The dowager tried to have him killed for slighting her, but he didn't care. 
Uh, love at first sight. Falling in love across a crowded ballroom. Sounds like something out of a children's. We story. probably shouldn't giggle about he that, Crash. He's a rogue, and any defects he might have had were made up for with rank and importance. It That's was shallow. A more innocent time, I suppose. And now he's gone, and I, I must write to his son Laurent. And his sister will make a terrible fuss if she isn't informed first. And I'll need to arrange for the Chantry services. Maker only knows how long that will take. Is there anything I can do to help? If I can help you, just say the word. No, my dear. I'll handle everything. Excuse me, I have so much to do. Hat of Majesty Enchanter's seat. You walked physically through the Fade. Please tell me what you remember. Uh, it wasn't the first time. I was physically in the Fade at the Temple of Sacred Ashes, too. You didn't ask about that. Darling, you didn't remember anything. Questioning you would have hardly been productive. Why did she get no so quiet? I think my TV's getting fucked up. Since the Magisters assaulted the Golden City. Oh, I'm positively envious Because it seems right like now. it's not that... Low. Anyways, I want to help the circle. Is there anything I can do to help your efforts at restoring the circle? After the circles fell, their libraries were plundered by scavengers. A thousand years of recorded knowledge in the hands of bandits. It makes me sick to think of it. I've received news that some tomes have been located, if you are interested in writing this wrong. I'll help find them. I'll look into it for you. Is it another character quest? Matter, the circle would be in your or is it kind of like, oh, does everyone have like two? Jesus Christ. Uh, Alright, well, let's go talk to Dorian because he was being yelled at by the reverence. I don't know what you think you're doing. I'm being clucked at by a hen, evidently. Fucking really? Don't play the fool with me, young man. If I wanted to play the fool, I could be rather more convincing, I assure you. Your glib tongue does you no credit. Is this the third time this episode? You'd be surprised at the credit my tongue gets me, Your Reverence. Okay, cutscene. Oh, I... What's going on here? It seems the revered mother is concerned about my undue influence over you. It is just concern. Your Worship, you must know how this looks. You might need to spell it out, my dear. This man is of Tevinto. His presence at your side. The rumors alone. Because he's Tevinter. What's wrong with him being from Tevinter, specifically? I'm fully aware that not everyone from the Imperium is the same. Uh, it doesn't seem that way. Kind of you to notice. Yet still, you bow to the opinion of the masses. The opinion of the masses is based on centuries of evidence. What would you have me tell them? The truth? The truth is I do not know you, and neither do they. Thus, these rumors will continue. Tell me about these rumors. Oh? I'd like to hear what these rumors are, exactly. I... could not repeat them, you Oh, wish. this is gonna be good. Repeat them? So, you've shared them before. I... see. I meant no disrespect, Inquisitor. Only to ask after this man's intentions. If you feel he is without ulterior motive, then I humbly beg forgiveness of you both. You give me the evil eye. Well, that's something. Uh, this happen often? This sort of thing happens often, does it? <laughs> More than anyone tells you. No one knows their own reputation. Until someone helpfully informs them. There is that. She meant well, if that's of any concern. I should ask, do the rumors bother you? There will always be rumors. Why should it bother me? Everyone's talking about the Inquisition. That's good. I'd hate to think I brought you any grief. Perhaps it's odd to say, but I think of you as a friend, Inquisitor. Oh yeah, of course. I have precious few friends. I didn't think to find one here. I... Uh... Don't speak. I detest confessions, and I'd like to get this over with. What was Allow I about me to, to say? I'll stand beside you, against Corypheus, my countryman, or spurious rumor, so long as you'll have me. 
cool. Did I go talk to Mother Jeremiah Johnson? She's usually down here, right? You know what? I don't see her, so I'm not going to bother. Okay, we get another quest from Vivian. Um, where exactly are those tomes? Oh, they're, they're all fucking over the place. Um, oh, is this Tementor? Okay, we gotta go up there. Okay, that's not too far. We can just travel up from there and get it. And there's Tementor down here. And that should be it for Dorian's other quest. So, instead of getting, like, Iron Bull's character quest, let's go around and do this. We also have, like, Blackwall's quest, but we'll get to that in a bit. All right. We're here in Antelands. Actually took a longer break than I was expecting. I went to get a drink and I'm like, oh, you know, I'll go through my mail. I'm upstairs and look at my mail and there's this letter to, addressed to me in my car. And on it was like a warning like, penalty of jail time and fine up to $5,000 or both if this is interfered with in getting to the addressee. I'm like, whoa, what? What is this? So I open it. And it's just a goddamn fucking ad for coverage that they're offering for because I bought my car from them. <sighs> Amazing, right? I like had a mini heart attack. I'm like, what the fuck are they talking about? Why why is this so serious? No, nah, it wasn't serious at all. In fact, it was just spam. So that's what happens. I guess. I would assume that's yeah. I mean it might be in this house. Probably better to go on foot and do the little sonar thing. Uh, for party, I have Cassandra, Dorian, and Vivian here. Because we're going to be doing something for everyone but Cassandra. Uh, next time, we'll start off by talking to Iron Bull and uh, seeing if they have anything to say. Is it inside? No. Oh, I have to get up there? How do I get up there? Over here? Is this gonna be one of those I cut to when I find out how to get up there? Or did I just find it? I think I just found it. Potentially. Uh, I think I did. Get up there, Karash. You got this. Climb, climb. Dude, come on. Jesus Christ, you're like seven foot. Ah, yeah, totally got this. Is there no one here? Have I ever been here before? I had to have been here before. I should check up there, because it could be up there, even if it is on the outskirt of the purple stuff. Was not the side I was expecting to climb up, to be honest. And also, there's nothing up here. Amazing. Ow. Yeah, we can totally jump over that. It has to be up here. Right? I mean, it has to be someone here. This is where the goddamn circle of purple is. If it's not up here, then... the hell is it gonna be? That has to be it right there. Take! Thank you. Vivian slightly approves. I feel like I just stole a tome. Anyways, we need to travel... to a couple of different locations. Let's go to this one first. And travel south. We'll finish up with... hopefully this area. And might be able to get to those other areas with the other tomes, depending on how far away from spawn points they are. I'll have to check, though. If this ever loads. There we go. Come here, Epona. Where are you? There you are. There's also monsters surrounding the camp. That's ominous. Oh, they're bears. Okay, let's get the hell out of here then. They can take care of them. I wish I did charging damage on the horse. Like, I just could have just trampled that fox. So it's it's a little sick, I know. 
So the last Venatory people were kind of like clustered up together next to each other in like a wedge of a mountainside. Think it will be a trend? Yeah, it might be a trend. Oh, there's no way I'm climbing that. Might not need to though. I'm gonna assume I'm totally gonna need to somehow climb that. Eh, maybe not. Maybe there's a pathway. Yeah. <laughs> maybe. Oh, please let there be an easy way up. Like right there. Totally looks like a pathway, right? Oh yeah, totally is. There they are. I have them to set up camp. Totally in a stealth. Oh, beautiful. I'm like missing him. Oh, he's dead. Alright. Assassin Dukin! Fomoria? I think we're in the wrong universe for that, buddy. Hey, nothing wrong with a little Moria now and then. Next up is here, which I can just... Oh, we're in combat. Alright, get out of combat. Alright, there we go. Let's go north. Yeah, we could be playing like... What's wrong with the traveling thing? It's glitching out. I'm gonna say we could be playing like a uh, uh, Lord of the Ring game. We want to go to Moria. Lord of the Rings Online. Or... Uh, Uh, that PlayStation 2 game. Two Towers. Was Moria in the Shadow of Mordor? That was an alright game. Mordor, Shadow of Mordor. It was pretty grindy, though, to be quite honest. It was more grindy than I was expecting. Um, but it, was, it wasn't bad. It was like a more action-focused Assassin's Creed. I'm saying that with very little Assassin Creed knowledge, but going by what I know of Black Flag. So, take that with a grain of salt. A lot less, you know, pirates in Shadow of Mordor, though. What is wrong with you? Oh, you just have a giant buff. Also, fuck you. Who else wants to die? Assassin Dugan! Oh, oh! oh. <laughs> Alright. The other three can take care of that guy by themselves. Cassandra's just standing there. Good job, Cassandra. What are you guys doing? Attack him. Is it because he's feared? Jesus Christ. Fine. I got this. Again. I just killed that whole group by myself. You happy? Darken Simmet. Interesting. Alright, so we cleared out... I'm not even going to bother checking out that requisition. It's going to be the same one over and over again. Um, no more diamonds. Which are a girl's best friend, by the way. And a man's, if he likes money. The next tome is supposedly... That's not it. Let's not do that one. It's over here. Well, let's look at Blackwell's quest. All right, so we need to go here, here, we've already been there, and here, the black wall. Maybe we'll do that next time. Now, where is this? That's literally right next to a camp. That is so goddamn easy. Follow the trail. We've already done that. All right. You all right, Karash? Oh, okay. You're just meditating like Piccolo? Right. Alright, let's uh That is right, I am the Inquisitor. Yeah. Let's go to this point and find this tomb. Tome, not tomb, tome. Tombs are different things. Can we just climb up here? That makes things a lot yeah. easier. Whoa. I feel like I shouldn't be up here. enemies 
I also see the book. Uh, still good. Hey, everyone. Oh, you motherfuckers are assassins? I would like to dismount now. Thank you. Oh, oh, you you're done, sons. You're done. I don't even know what I'm referencing anymore when it comes to that. Level 15, though. White Claw Raiders. We will take this. Thank you very much. And research supplies. Oh, we got that other quest. And an assassin weapon. And a landmark. Let's just grab this. Oh, this must be a quarry. How can you slightly approve of that? this here? Venatori? No. Okay. That should help with some construction. Yeah, superior tower. Upgrade Skyhold's main tower. Alright, well we can do that. And... We got a lot of other stuff to do here too. Let's try the next location, which is Exalted Plains. We are right here. Aren't we? It's right there. We got a camp right there. That's super easy. Yeah, I like these side quests when they're right next to the place. <laughs> Just trying to mount that guy for a minute. Yeah, I like these side quests when they're right next to like spawn points and uh, teleportations. It makes it so much easier. Generally speaking, the story of the game is really good. The side quest portion, aside from the character quests, have been kind of... Well, things I don't actually want to do. I had that same complaint with uh, Xenoblade Chronicles. Like, the main story was awesome. Side quests, not so much. But, I understand why they're there. And hopefully through the character quests, I can unlock uh, enough power to go through all the remaining map nodes. Because I don't really want to do the side quests. And looks like we got a lot, a lot of enemies ahead. They're at level 11, though. So, you know, <laughs> they're fucked, to be quite honest. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, I would cut this out normally because there's like so many of them, but they're so weak. Sazendukin! Uh, Sazendukin. Okay. Can I block it? Fine. The deals are ours! What do you mean we're dead? Sounds like someone just said, eat shit. I mean, that's fair. We just annihilated their group. If my last words are going to be anything, it's probably going to be like, eat shit. Or fuck you, or fuck off. Uh, Joycelyn. I don't trust the Gordon, Gordon, Gordine fellow. He talks as though he's Orlesian, but no, he's not. I can hear it in his speech. Tell me you hear it too. I wonder what he's doing on that raise. He's forbidden us from going there, but I might take a look in a couple of nights. Let me know if you want in. Have you heard anything from the Emerald Graves? They said the Dahamin Dean's gone. There's two there to lead the Freeman. Damn, I miss him. He was a good commander. A bastard, but fair. Gus. What? Okay. And Red Velvet. Let's find that book. Is that... Okay, you're a statue. I was about to be pissed at whoever that was. I was like, did you just stand there while I fought off these guys? I don't care how weak they are. Help! Just help. We're here to help you. Help us help you. Holy crap, there's a ladder up here. Oh, loot! Absolutely. Absolutely crap. I get that? Eh, fuck it. Oh, take? Thank you. Return to Vivian. Hello, Vivian. Eh, fuck you too then. Alright, let's find... Let's go back up here and get that treasure. And then we'll go talk to Dorian. 
And then, then Vivian. Because we did finish quest for both of you. Just loot the goddamn thing. Thank you for the elf root. All right, let's go back to Sihole. Uh, no, uh, no reverence. Something bitching him out, huh? Uh, we sh begin a romance with Dorian. Um, flattered, but I'm kind of seeing something. I should go. Can I see both of them at the same time? I also I thought you'd be kind of interested in the fact that I just killed a bunch of uh, Venatori with you. But I guess not. All right, Vivian, you're up. I expected ruins. They were. As you see, the Inquisition has not been idle. Oh, would it be I hate possible those goddamn masks. to meet the Herald before we return to Ghislaine? My dear Laurent, for you, anything. Yeah. What's up, Josephine? We'll go make out in front of Morgan and her son later. Allow me to present Inquisitor Adar. Your worship, you do us great honor. Inquisitor, this is my dear Bastien's sister, Grand Cleric Marceline, and his son, Duke Laurent, the Council of Heralds. Madame de Fer has told us what great trials you faced, trying to save my poor brother's life. The Maker called my father to his side. It was valiant of you to champion him in his final hours. And tell me what you've heard now. Uh, I wish I had done more, even though she tried to trick me into doing it. If only I'd been able to save Bastien. The Circle of Magi told Bastien many years ago that his illness was incurable. It was simply his time. Would you mind waiting for me in the chapel, my dears? The Inquisitor and I have business to discuss. It has been our very great pleasure, Harold. Alright, you guys want to die for my cause? No? So you've met the family now, and made a good impression in spite of yourself. Well done. You spoke highly of me. <laughs> yeah, quite. Yes, you're scheming. Well, we know that. Wait, you talked them into supporting the Inquisition? Of course I did, my dear. Properly worded, the righteous cause of the Inquisition can be used to great effect with my Bastien's deeply pious relations. With Bastien's loss, I have connections to the Council of Heralds and the highest levels of the Chantry. All thanks to you. Wait, did she poison the old man? I'm, like, confused by this. She seemed like she was trying to save him, but now that he's dead, she seems to be in a higher position. Uh, well, things worked out then. Or you always get what you want. You use me. Well, we knew she was using me. Things worked out then. Well, at least everything's worked out for you in the end. So it has. And well arranged, if I do say so myself. Well, I can't keep Marceline and Laurent waiting. Thank you so much for your cooperation, Inquisitor. I could never have done this without your help. People person. What's that? Oh, well, whatever. I'll check that later. Uh, that confused me. That did confuse me, because she seemed like that's what she was plotting the whole time. And if... That's what she was plotting the whole time. That's kind of fucked up. Especially after all that sob story she told me. But then again, if she's using me... Oh, good, your stuff faded, phased in. Yes? Yeah, I, I, it's done. Your lost books have been found. Your assistance in this matter will not be forgotten, I assure you. Right. Anything else? Yes. No. Okay. Uh, that's going to be it for this episode. Uh, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press the like button below. There's fucking stairs here? Ah. Ah.
I mean, it wouldn't have saved that much time, but anyways, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press the like button below. If you're not subscribed yet, why don't you hit on my video section, check out some of my other content, and see if it's to your liking. Next time, we'll start off by talking to Iron Bull, and uh, I, I can go upgrade my towers, too. I'll do that next time as well. Yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you all have a great day.